Hey, yo, what's up, everybody? It's me and it's Z. That's mm -hmm. my boy. We just drove 114 miles across Michigan to finally get home. And there's nobody here, and that's a great time to make a video. To just say we had a great time uh, over at AJ's Cam, Average Joe Ministries. We were working on his final album. Uh, it's going to be entitled The Process. It's going to be a great album. I am extremely biased because I'm I'm working on the album, so I have to tell you that it's gonna be great. But no, we listened to the music, we were doing some cool stuff, and it's amazing. And in that time that I was working with Joe, we had a conversation about your boy Beacon. Now, for those of you guys who don't know, Beacon Light has been in the Christian rap music industry for about nine or ten years now, about as long, maybe longer than I have, and he's made tremendous strides. And he has recently released a new album. Now, when it comes to... I, I, don't, I don't have to tell you guys this. But I'm going to tell you anyway. Okay? When it comes to Christian rap, uh, we can all pretty much think two things. Three things. Okay? We think, you know, I like KJ52 and I like Lecrae. Uh, and then everything else is generally in this area right here just it's the state of christian rap has just been doo-doo and i'm sorry that if that offends everybody but i'm just gonna keep it real it's just been doo-doo um i write terrible music uh all of my friends write terrible music um and and then especially everybody on forums that isn't me and, and my friends writes terrible music. Now, once in a while, somebody writes some great stuff, and that's the stuff that stays in our MP3 players. You guys know what I'm talking about. Um, and a lot of it is the classic stuff, like uh, what, like I said, KJ52, I said Lecrae, I said Fanatic, um, you know, some famous people. But then you got like some really highly underrated artists like Beacon Light, LON, um, that might be it. Oh, Marcus Anthony just released uh, You You Can't Make Me Doubt Him. Oh, uh, what's, what's uh, Brother Dre? How could I forget Brother Dre? I'll tell you, because he's so good. He's like, he, he you forget about him. You know, like you're standing in front of a mountain and you don't see it because it's so big. Like, that's how good Brother Dre is. Um, And for the most part, I mean, and you'll notice I don't even include myself or a Black Sheep Squad in his list. Like, it's just, it's not where it should be. And we are trying and that's amazing, and, and AJ might actually make this list, but right now on that list is Beacon Light. Now, I go through all this to say the reason that us uh, broke Christian rapper consumers don't support Christian rap is because we're cheap. Now, it's a lousy 10 bucks, and so I'm taking this video to, to insult literally everyone in my fan base and, and, and my uh, uh, friend, circle of friends and saying that we make terrible music, so we should, in because we make terrible music, we should support the good stuff. So here it is. This is the lousy $10 challenge, okay? It costs a lot more than $10 to make an album, and your boy Beacon made a great album. So here's my, here's my, here's what I'm doing here. I'm going to see if I can, I can't flip this around while I'm recording. So I'm going to take this phone here. And I'm gonna go to Amazon. And I'm sorry, I don't use iTunes. Okay, I'm I'm a I'm a Android. I'm a broke rapper. Okay, we don't do we don't do that here in this household. We use Amazon. Get off the table, boy. So on Amazon.com, I'm gonna type in Beacon Light. B E A C O N. There he is. He he already comes up. Beacon Light. I hope you can see this. Ba -bam. And that's not Beacon Light music at all. <laughs> So I'm going to type in Beacon Light in digital music. You like looking at yourself in that camera, don't you? Now, you guys heard the Lit album. You know, you already know. You already know. So Beacon Light, his, his new album is called Loud Drive Home. It is 949. Now, what did I say? The lousy 10 bucks challenge. It's a lousy 10 bucks. If you're not supporting, you don't care. And that's why when we were back there in the at, at the toilet, when I was saying that Christian rap is doo doo, that's why. Because it's a lousy ten bucks. So we're gonna go here, and I hope you can see this because I am going to buy Beacon Lights album, like unlimited goodness. Like I can play this now as many times as I want. And when my battery dies, then I'll go over to my computer because I bought it through Amazon. You know, so I got it like that. A lousy ten bucks. Okay. Now it's your turn. I'm going to tag a bunch of people in this album. You're going to go out. You're going to buy it. You're going to support it. And you're going to enjoy it. Because there's like 
10 good Christian rappers, and this is one of them. And this is going to be probably his best album, you know? It's not like you buy or listen to it and it's like bad, you know? It's not like you're like, oh, I wish I never bought this. Like, there's never been a Beacon album like that, you know? At the very worst, you were like, okay, it's pretty good. That's at the worst. You've never heard a Beacon Light song and been like, oh, no, I don't like it. Like, li like literally everyone else, you're like, why did I spend this money? It's a lousy 10 bucks, okay? Do not go see Black Panther. Do not go see all of them other dumb movies out there. If you want to entertain yourself, if you want something that's got unlimited value, you're going to go to Amazon like I just did. You're going to buy that. See where it says thanks? Because I just bought Beacon Light's album, and now I'm tagging you to do it. It's the $10, it's the lousy $10 challenge. I'm going to call it that. It might sound derogatory, but it's a lousy 10 bucks, okay? This dude needs to be supported in what he's doing so he can keep making good music and that you don't have to listen to doo-doo, okay? It's boy zero. I'm out. <laughs>